here's this quick unboxing of a solar panel, 10 watt. So, here it is. I'm just gonna take it apart. So basically, we bought this over eBay. I took three weeks to get here, which is pretty fast since uh, from China things are getting really, really late here. Um, they usually take from a month to 45 days. But uh, this one made it faster than that, so that's good. Um, it was on Expedia. Anyways, um, just to give you a quick... So let me just show you some of the details from it. But um, I will compare the size of it to a uh, iPad. So you guys can get kind of an idea of how big this 10 watt solar panel is. So that's an iPad. So let me just put it right to the edge. And that's the solar panel. So it's just a little bit over an iPad. The width, uh, the height is almost just a bit more. Okay. So not too much, but uh, not so small either. So the width is what there. So maybe it's like two iPads, something like that. Um, this is an iPad 4 just in case. It's uh, not the mini. So that's around how big it is. Um, you do have this plastic on that you have to take off before using it. Um, the cables, they have tape on. So here you can see the specs of the um, solar panel. So it's a 10 watt, okay. 17.9 volt. So this you would hook up to your battery. And it's supposed to charge up your battery, so such as like car battery or batteries like that. Okay, it doesn't have to be strictly a car battery, but something like that. Um, you would hook this up to the ends. Okay, positive, negative ends. Okay, these open up. Now, if your solar panel doesn't come with these, don't worry about it. You can always attach these. I mean, some of the solar panels just come with the cable itself, so you would just. Uh, attach these onto the cable. Okay, it's not hard. It's just you know something extra you would have to do if you didn't buy a solar panel like this. Now something I would be careful with it. Here's the negative. Here's the positive. Okay, so I would just be careful with these endings. Okay, uh, even from the pictures it looked pretty uh, delicate. Now, from what I can see, there's no damages or anything on it. Just, just a little bit, maybe just a little bit there, but um. No biggie. I will let the uh, seller know that it came like that. Obviously, he didn't wrap it. He just wrapped it around this. It should have come in a box to protect it. One. I mean, these are pretty fragile, so I don't know why he shipped it like that. So I'm just gonna take this off. That's the plastic that protects it. Obviously, you can't leave this on. The pipe melt onto it, and that will basically damage it. Um, something that you shouldn't do with these is actually touch the solar panel itself. Um, I don't think you'll damage it, but definitely um, you won't do any good to it anyways. Now, things that you have to check on your solar panel, if it's the construction is okay. So let me just zoom in on it. It looks okay. I'll let you know on um, the review how I made this work and uh, how long it worked and everything. This is just the unboxing video so you guys can get a glimpse and how it looks like uh, it doesn't weigh anything really it's just plastic and that's it guys uh, don't forget to subscribe and rate and don't forget to watch the review of this solar panel